here as he arrived in his Golan Stadium at the Kentucky Horse Park. Karen O'Connor, the 52-year-old veteran from the United States from the Plains, Virginia, aboard Mandiva, a 10-year-old Bay Gelding Irish thoroughbred. She brings in her score of 45.6 after the cross country. Karen, a longtime veteran, rode in her first Olympics in 1988. Tim, and I thought she rode like a veteran yesterday, and she needed to, she had to, and she did it. Now she's got to come in and lay down a clean trip to keep the U.S. in contention. So you land and just give a little bit of leg. Say, come on, you've got to give me more than that. Don't bump these rails. Riders get nervous when they bump the rails because it means the horse is not quite clearing it. Now we're talking. And she got her opportunity as uh, Kim Severson that was on the team, the tipper right the on the, the horse that came down with an illness and had to be withdrawn before the competition began. And so the cup was for Kim Severson, but it gave, it gave Karen O'Connor the opportunity to be riding for the U.S. team. And she's making the most of her opportunity. Look at that inside turn sheet. Oh, oh, oh. The whole stuff she had her refusal at a simple vertical gate. You heard the bell go, that, that tone in the background. It means means that they held the time until they restart the clock. They've got, got to get the jump built back up. Then she will start again. You hear the tone go. Now she's got to keep coming so she doesn't get time faults. What an unusual occurrence. She knocks it down. That's going to count also. She can't let this rattle her, Tim. The costly penalties. She's got to keep her cool. She's got a lot of hard jumps to go. Turn back now. Around over this. Next to where she had a problem there at 7. And jump to Liverpool. Wow, what a heartbreaker for Karen and Mandiba. Keeping her, keeping her balance, keeping her poise now. Make sure he jumps these. Keep coming. Big yellow rails. Over that combination. One more after this to the finish line. Should have a couple of time penalties as well. 93.53, 3.53 over the time. And a penalty is 57.6. So a tough ride for Karen O'Connor aboard Mandiba.